Peace, love, and light, Scorpios. I hope the sun is shining wherever you are and you're living in your greatest purpose. Scorpios, thank you for all your likes, comments, shares, and subscribes. We are on the road to 10K. Thank you for your support and getting there. Personal readings are being done at this time. All information can be found in the description box as well as the community tab. Let's get into your messages. I'm seeing some major things about um, transformation. Uh, many of you are going through major transformation. Also, um, it's like, you know, things are transforming and it's like, like there's a lot of changes and I'm seeing it's more like, it's a lot of changes within that's going to influence what's happening, um, you know, on the surface level. Okay, let me just make sure this stays. Okay. Yeah, there's like, there's a lot of, um, there's a lot of changes taking place for you. Um, I'm led to do a May reading uh, for the month of May just to get the overall energy of what is going to show up for you. <laughs> All right. Show us the energy for Scorpio for the month of May, Spirit. Mm, page of swords and knight of wands mm. like the very first thing that i'm getting from here is like there's a lot of energy coming from the knight of wands it's like you're making a lot of noise you're making a lot of noise and it's like um It's, it's going to create a lot of like subtle changes that are going to be mind-blowing. I'm hearing May is going to be mind-blowing. Like this page of swords is an energy of like learning, studying, taking new information in. Uh, the Knight of Wands is an energy. It, it's just... It's giving off a lot of energy. So this may allude to your creativity, what you're learning, um, how you're transforming also mentally, spiritually, and in your connections. Page of Wands, Page of Swords. A lot of energy of creativity showing up. Okay. I'm hearing May is going to be mind-blowing for you. Mind-blowing, huh? Okay. Mind-blowing indeed. Let's check this out. What is... What's happening? Tell me about the Knight of Wands. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, so for the Knight of Wands. Okay. Finances, finances, finances. Someone's beating the drums on the finances. It's like, yeah, it's time. Someone's beating the drums. It's like you it's like you trying to walk towards this. You trying to walk towards this this financial new beginning for May. Many of you uh let's see here. Many of you may be walking away from something. You walking away from something or someone may actually bring you a financial new beginning.
walking away from something or walking toward something okay yeah this energy of walking away is showing up here as well so it's showing up in the five of wands and it's showing up in the eight of cups wheel of fortune okay what are you walking away from some of you may actually be abandoning some plans that you have okay so i'm seeing here queen of cups energy mm. some of you are actually I'm, I'm seeing that there's a lot of people that you may be choosing to walk away from permanently Part of the part of this has to deal with like uh, your focus. It has to deal with your um, the plans that you have that you're working on for yourself. Many many actually the people that you're gonna be walking away from, it's like their minds are gonna be blown because. Yeah, you see that? It's like it's like they some some of the these engines are gonna be revving up. Some of these people that you walked away from are they're they're still in disbelief. Um Some of you may be choosing to walk away from something so you can focus on your plans, your dreams. Uh, there's a queen of cups. This may be a water sign. Uh, this queen of cups may also represent the things that are very dear to you that you're choosing to focus on. Like you're following your dreams. Like I'm hearing that it's it's this right here it it's like there's a skill that you are learned that you are um choosing to hone in on you're focusing on that you're following it you're pursuing it and part of the reason why you're choosing to focus on your skill this page of this knight of wands knows that like choosing to you know it's like showing discipline i'm seeing here this knight of wands represents discipline you're choosing to show discipline in some craft that you're doing something that you you have dedicated your life because you know that if you focus on it if you if you do a then you're gonna get b it's like you're you're seeing a cause and effect you're you're seeing that very clearly for the month of May, like you're choosing to focus on that. Um, you may also, with this Knight of Wands, you may also come into partnership with someone, like it. it's looking like there's a connection that you have that has something to do with, um, your skills so you may choose to actually partner with someone and share um share your skills and for some of you this is actually someone that you're in an intimate connection with someone that's showing up in the emperor energy and or this is actually you both showing up as two bosses like you're showing up as two bosses and I'm still seeing that this connection that, you know, there may be a love connection where you choose to actually go into business uh, with one another. You choose to kind of you choose to share your skills or uh, something that you're choosing to share uh, to bring something 
about like uh, both of you could also be learning a new skill or um, it's like you take both of your skills together or you take multiple skills together to create something and again this partnership for many of you may actually be someone that you are you know this is like a this is like a, a life partner that you're choosing to go in business with and this is this is the time for you to learn this is the time for you for many of you this connection you're going to learn a lot about your connection because of this partnership some of you may be hesitant to go into business with someone that you are intimately connected with someone that you know it's like it's like that energy of not mixing business with pleasure i'm seeing that you know it's going to bring fruit it's going to bring recognition and for whatever reason there's something about the connection that may be healed as a result of like this partnership like partnering up in in business for some of you again i'm hearing may's gonna be mind-blowing you see that that ten of pentacles is showing up recognition and financial advancement is is gonna come you know from something you're learning and also whatever you're learning it may have to do with like putting two two and two like putting putting your skills together to you know to create something that's that's gonna be successful this this partnering actually may bring healing and rejuvenation in regards to finances in this relationship it may actually help you to move forward um may actually help the partnership to move forward okay so take it as it resonates this is not for um all of you this two of cups has like an aspect of like working together to avoid financial hardship to you know to walk away from you know some financial hardship so your spirit guides could be telling you that there's some you know there may be some like uh harder times or challenging times coming financially um not necessarily for you on a more you know on a larger scale and i'm seeing that this partnering um some kind of partnering is going to help you to maintain your finances and and you know it's it's like you're dodging the struggles that will come you know there's some financial struggles to watch out for and this is part of what your spiritual team is trying to tell you so uh whatever creative ideas that you have um and you know whatever partnership you may have been thinking about you know bringing together your spirit guides are telling you this is the time because i'm seeing that there may be some periods of you know there may be some challenges ahead you know there may be some challenges ahead that you know your spirit guides are are letting you know that creatively your energy um it's like you know when you're this is also the time when you're going to find that you know you may have a lot more energy um to start something new to create new things new ideas are going to be coming towards you a lot of you may even have the energy um uh, to move you know from this hermit ma hermit made <laughs> hermit mode mm. Some of you actually may be traveling in the very near future as well. Um, hmm. Anything else you want to tell us? It's like your spirit guides are trying to point you in the right direction. Hmm. 
Okay. Mm-hmm. All right. Yeah, so this is part of the reason why um, your spirit guides are telling you that May is going to be mind-blowing because it's like your spirit guides are putting the pieces together. Whatever, whatever, um, you're going to reach this, you're going to reach this Ten of Pentacles and your spirit guides are getting you in a position to be like financially set. And right now your spirit guides are putting the pieces of the puzzle together for you to be, uh, financially abundant. And this is part of the reason why I'm hearing you're going to like, your mind is going to be blown as to how like the pieces come together, um, regarding like a lot of the concerns that you may have had regarding partnership finances it's like they're all going to come together and there's a bigger plan in motion again having to do with something that your spirit guides are um it's like they're protecting you from uh let's see here hmm okay liberation queen nanny your spirit guides are tr maybe trying to liberate liberate you financially. Well, dang. Okay. I do and I accept. <laughs> okay. So this is what this is saying. Uh, hmm. It's saying break free. Your dreams hold the power and keys to your liberation. You are freedom herself. Rise up. You deserve to feel free. What do you imagine for yourself? Daring to manifest your dreams is part of personal liberation. Find your own personal liberation codes in your soul's unspoken desires. Life is short to live within someone else's story. Divine blessings and magic are on your side. Enjoying your freedom fully is the best gift to your ancestors. Goddess declarations, my dreams empower me. This, for many of you, you're you're moving towards a position where you're going to be financially free. You're moving towards financial freedom. What this means to you, okay, take it as it resonates because it means different things for different folks. Financially free, financial freedom, okay? This is this is you being able to do what you will. Having the keys. It's like uh, that pieces of the puzzle that I was getting. It's like your spirit guides are unlocking the pieces of the puzzle. It's unlocking the pieces to your financial liberation. Like getting you ready. Hmm. Let me see what else is uh, showing up here. You're doing something. You're getting yourself or your spirit guides are getting you ready for this new beginning that's coming. And yes, Scorpios, you've heard it said before that it's coming. It sure enough is. Um, tell us more. Anything else you want us to know regarding this reading? Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay now. There's that magician energy showing up again. The sun showing up again. Yep. And roots of earth. If I'm not mistaken, I think this is like... This may be a Ten of Pentacles energy. 38. Okay, this is a page of Pentacles. This is this is that good. This is the good news about what you about to manifest financially. That's coming. It's as <clears throat> okay. So it says, "Do you really want it, or do you want to continue to woulda coulda?" You must take advantage of the opportunities that are presenting themselves. You are in the beginning stages of something great. Be careful not to overcommit to too many things and too many people. Plant your seeds. Stay groomed. You are a good student. This is you in the page of swords. Being a good student. You're learning as the universe, you know, unveils certain things. Okay? 
it says um plant your seeds and stay grounded you're a good student there may be education related news root spirits are message bearers good financial news is also on the way this is if this isn't confirmation i don't know what is for you okay good news follows me what else do you need to know oh and also it's saying um root er, root of earth is focused and loyal with a sense of humor no matter what this ancestry energy remains unbroken to honor this energy stop sitting on your ideas take the next step so there you go your ideas are about to make you wealthy that's what i'm hearing you're about your ideas are about to make you wealthy and that's it your ideas are gonna make you wealthy and stop sitting on them there's a bigger plan unfolding trust the universe trust your spirit guides because it is time for you this plan that's unveiling it involves you being financially free all right this is the message for you if this message resonates please like comment share and subscribe until next time love peace and divine light